Hey, how do I turn the volume down on this though? Hold this, I'm gonna go test out the uh, like the distance and shit. These dogs gonna start barking, bro. Penny? And we're back. What are we doing, bro? We're getting this LLC. What are you starting up? I don't even know if I know how to spell my middle name, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you, it's got an I and an E. I wasn't too good in school. <laughs> I'm, start I'm starting a business. Payment status complete. <laughs> I thought that was a real person standing right there. What is this? Where's Jaden? Long time no see. Do I need a better light? Go over there. Hello, everybody. Today we're at my good friend Jaden Barnes' house. People know who he is. They play They play his game. They play his video games. No, but, uh, huh? No, but we're at Jaden's house, so. Kind of a big deal. I forgot I'm not mic'd up, so nobody Yeah, you're not mic'd up, bro. <laughs> Jaden, there's a wasp right there. Me? No, <laughs> kidding, bro. Dude, he's deathly afraid of us. We're filming a hands down the best quality episode of Jason's Driven that you have ever seen in the most badass car you've ever seen me drive. This is a uh, what is this? <laughs> 2021 Toyota Corolla Nightshade Edition. What's it called? Is it Nightshade or is it Nighthawk? Nightshade. Oh, Nightshade? Seriously, dude, I'm more of a car enthusiast than I thought. Dude, I wish I could have a wireless mic on all the time. This is great. That's a wasp. That's a wasp. Dude. <laughs> This man is terrified of wasps. We rigged up the mic here, and then over here is where the camera is rigged up. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna rig up the camera like we did the mic. So we need to undo all this and get a shit ton of duct tape. It's gonna be a long journey. <laughs> this camera's trash, bro. I hate this camera. <laughs> What's up, dude? What's up, Penny? Don't pee pee, okay? Yeah, you should. Aww. Huh? What'd you say? <laughs> a camera is? Yeah. My bad. Dude, this is a beautiful day, man. Let's go ride some Harleys. No. This is disgusting. Today, we're gonna try to diagnose a problem with my motorcycle and hopefully solve the problem. <laughs> <laughs> so this is my ride for the day, right? No, this is your ride for the next five minutes. I don't think I've properly introduced this motorcycle to the channel. This is my 2001 Kawasaki Vulcan 800 Classic. My father gave this to me when I graduated high school. He told me if you graduate high school, then I will give you my old motorcycle. So that's what he did. And it's a little scratched up, a little dinged here and there. This fell over when I moved to Houston. It fell over on my drum set and the trailer. About wrecked because the trailer shifted and I was going like 60, 70 miles an hour. The whole thing started shaking and going everywhere. But anyways, my brother Ryan is trying to convince me to start building this thing. I don't know. I might slowly start knocking it out. I just wanted to properly introduce the bike to the channel because it's going to be featured on there a lot. I don't know if any of my subscribers knew that I had a motorcycle, but I do. If you want to watch any of my old moto vlogs, just scroll down my channel a little bit and you'll see probably four, five, six moto vlogs. And I also have one on my little brother's moped that he used to have. So y'all go check those out. Um, but I guess we're going to proceed with the video. get these tools ready i suppose oh i also i want to show you guys my toolbox this is my new toolbox i got it for christmas these are all the tools that i accumulated from lowe's a couple things uh, i got some wrenches uh, this basically i'm not going to run through everything i got this is just like a i mean a, i don't know a starter kit i had zero tools and now i have a decent amount of tools like anything i need i'll just go buy are these work gloves rut row up uh Rut bro. Got a washer down, came out of hell. You got some work gloves, bro? Bro, here's my air filter, bro. Am I supposed to be able to see light through this? Here's my air filter. Damn, bro. This is, so this is the carburetor right here. Yo, I just, yo, I just went ahead and took this shit off. Ryan, aren't, aren't you supposed to be like helping me? Cause this is your idea. So you're talking about taking the whole carburetor off? Are we taking this piece off? All right, so I decided to this. <laughs> we did a little bit of research. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the bike to a shop and let them do everything engine wise. As far as like, you know, taking things off like these brackets, these lights that I don't need, relocating the blinkers, getting new blinkers back here, we're doing anything with the exhaust, powder coating, any of that, any of the disassembly and relocation of anything, we're gonna do ourselves. And that is what you'll be able to see on the channel. As far as taking it to the shop, I'll, I mean, I'll throw a GoPro on and show y'all, you you know, me dropping it off. I mean, as far as like getting down to the technical nitty gritty of the engine, yeah, I'm not, yeah, we're not gonna do all that. 
<laughs> my friend Shamar is wanting to film a video. I'm gonna go help him. I'm gonna use some of my equipment, my GoPros, my camera, yada yada. I'm just hang out. The sun's out longer now, so it shouldn't be a problem getting the shots that he needs to get. But I guess I'm just gonna take you guys along for the ride and we'll just hang out, I guess. I don't know. I, I don't know, I'm just filming stuff. We're, we're gonna go. I got my, oh look, it's my new camera bag. I don't know if you can see it. It really doesn't matter if you can or can't. I got all my camera stuff. I wanna see I can hold twice as much camera equipment with this and my uh, MacBook. What's happening? Captain. I mean, look at this man, the 350Z, bro. Where are we going? The next spot is going to be across the bridge. Just follow me. Alright. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm pulling forward. Ah! Ah! 